All right, today we are at Hussmaker Violins in Duluth, Georgia. And this is La Fête de Violins. This has to do with the French exhibit of violins and bows. And what you see, this is downtown Duluth. Downtown Duluth is the home of the exhibit. And we also have an artistic program going on called Street Strings. For Street Strings, there were 200 violins painted by friends and relatives and little children. And in every shop, there is a painted violin hanging. And there are such, the creativity is beautiful. And ahead of me are the French violin makers. We have eight French violin makers in residence. This is this is 31. This was our first shop. Yes. This was our very first shop and they have it's empty right now. And they have violins in it. And we have ahead this is Valerie who has worked so hard today. Valerie has come all the way from Marseille to be with us. This is the Red Clay Theater across the street. And on the side of the building are some more of the street strings violins. They're in all kinds of colors. This is stained glass window place. More violins. More French makers. Say hello. Bonjour. 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 Yes. More street strings. For those of you who don't know, this was our old shop. This is the lovely Cecile who has also worked very, very hard today. Bonjour. 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 <laughs> there are violins everywhere. They are pausing to look at what, where Hutzmakers used to be years ago. This is the coolest one, if you can see this through the glare. This is a violin that they made into a camera. And here's a silver violin. And the Fall Festival violin. And more violins. Everywhere you go, there are violins today in Duluth, Georgia, as part of the street streets. Here on the side of the building, as the cars go by, more violins. This is the Duluth portraits, and they have violins hanging from the roof line all the way across. And then they have some really cool ones up here in a shadow box. Are we having fun yet? And here come all the violin makers wandering around Duluth. And right here is a mosaic by Jennifer Freeman. The fiddle crab was done by Phil McLemore, who is our city manager. And this is the jewelry one. One can never have too many jewelries.
This is our walkabout before we go to dinner and eat and drink and enjoy. Our, we've been working very hard all day long. All year long. Thank you for your attention. The tour of the violins is over.